Top stories on midday. Breaking news this morning. Law enforcement officers in Nolan County gathering evidence at Roscoe Collegiate High School after a dangerous incident on campus. KRBC's Heather Easley is in Roscoe this morning with the latest details. Heather, what can you tell us about this chilling morning? Yes, thank you, Monica. That's right. We are here outside of Roscoe Collegiate where we found out that a ninth grade student brought a personal handgun to school and attempted to take his own life inside of the school building. Now we spoke to Sergeant Couch of the DPS and he gave us more details on this incident. One of the things we're concerned about right now is just making sure the parents and the, and the, and the uh, students of Roscoe and Independent School Districts understand this student was not uh, here to do harm toward anyone else. Uh, there's been no threat to anyone on campus or anything like that. This case is currently under investigation uh, as far as we're trying to track down and trace down everything that occurred today to make sure we have everything uh, taken care of. Now we do know that the student is still alive and has been transported to Cook's Medical Center in the Dallas Fort Worth area and parents have actually been lined up this morning waiting to pick up their students. All campuses have been closed and the superintendent is actually calling in guidance counselors to start counseling for those students that that feel that they might need to speak to someone about the incident. We we aren't sure if any other students saw the incident or witnessed it, but we do know that it was was not a threat like Sergeant Couch said it was not a threat to the school it was not a threat to any other student so as soon as we find out more information we'll get back to you all right well thank you Heather as you can tell behind Heather it is just an empty scene kiddos already being picked up from school now Heather will have more details tonight on KRBC at 5 and 6 for details as they unfold head on over to our website bigcountryhomepage.com